who needs Tide Pod challenges or bleach challenges or whatever it is when you have people who tell you that it is good to drink urine, to be specific, camel urine. Unfortunately, I don't have camel urine here, I only have coke. Muslim apologist Farid is on his channel saying that it is scientifically confirmed that it is good to drink camel urine, it's beneficial. He's responding to our criticism of Muhammad's suggestion to drink camel urine. And he claims we are mocking this, but science is actually on his side and on the side of the Prophet Muhammad because science reveals that camel urine has beneficial components which may be used in medication. <sighs> now keep in mind that these are pregnant camels and the urine of pregnant mounts have healing properties. Look up Primarine which is made from pregnant mare urine. Dude, I'm looking at this right now, and even your screenshot says CEE -E is a natural formulation of an extract prepared from pregnant mares. This is estrogen, medication for hormones extracted from a horse's urine for hormone therapy. This does not mean they take a cup of horse urine and just pour it into the medicine and that's it. <laughs> In any case, Campbell urine has healing properties and all you gotta do is head over to PubMed and type it out, Campbell urine, in the search box and go through some of the articles there. Hey, but if you're too childish to accept that because, ew, you know, Campbell urine, unfortunately for you, science is on the side of Islam in this one. I don't really know how to say this. You don't have to be a scientist. You don't have to have some really advanced education in science to understand this, but just because there are beneficial components in something, and just because those beneficial components may be extracted and used for medical purposes, that does not mean that that whole thing is good for you. Yes, it is true. Urine has beneficial components which may be used in medications. This is not just true for camel urine, it's true for human urine as well. Question, does this mean it is good to drink human urine? According to most experts, it is definitely not. It is harmful, it does not help hydrate you, it might give you things that your body does not need that are excessive to your body or that are poisonous to your body. Urine is removed from your body. It is something that your body removes to get rid of it. You don't need it. So it's probably not a good idea to think, oh, look, waste, let me drink that. There are scientific studies on this discouraging the consumption of urine. There are studies on the urine of other animals, which show no benefit that can't be acquired from different things and which discourage drinking it. There are studies about human urine, which discourage drinking it. And in fact, there are studies about camel urine, which say that you should not drink it. The World Health Organization warns people not to drink camel urine because it may be responsible for a coronavirus one that is more serious than the one that we often talk about nowadays. I mean, please, is it really so hard to think this through? By the same logic, we also know that there are beneficial components in human feces, poop. Now, dear Farid and dear Muslim apologists and others, do you think it's a good idea to go ahead and eat poop? I will do my part and say don't do it, but if you want to prove your logic right, if you want to make a point, and if you really want to go ahead and prove to us that it is beneficial, then maybe you will realize when you sit at the doctor's office or when you are in a worse situation that you have made a big mistake. And maybe then you will sit down and say, you know what, guys, I don't have to defend everything that the prophet said and did. You know what, people, I don't have to justify everything that I think is right. I was wrong about this. Another example that somebody else brought up, which is alcohol. Alcohol has very, very great benefits. But Muslim apologists will tell us that it is terrible for you. It's very bad. You should never drink it. It's haram. It's filthy. Well, what's the problem? It has beneficial components. It's good for you in many ways. Why don't you go ahead and drink it? Raw meat has beneficial components. Why don't we go ahead and eat it? Guess what? Thousands of years of human evolution and learning have brought us to the point where we decided it's not a good idea to eat raw meat. What am I even doing here? I don't think I need to say this, but apparently I do need to say this. Please don't drink urine. See, this is what we deal with when we respond to you. This is why it's so exhausting and so undesirable. <laughs> Thank you and stay away from Islam.